but it's the night of a huge Aurora show apparently. It's meant to be almost a G3 um, geomagnetic storm. Pretty much a few days ago the sun released a solar flare that exploded and pretty much just shot a huge big thing of plasma uh, towards Earth and hopefully um, it's meant to hit Earth tonight at some point so we'll see if it actually does. Currently as you can see there's nothing in the sky um, there has been hints of red and greens being seen um, up north but they're just very faint so just waiting about I'm near kind of Perth Perth Caprangus area and we're just pretty much waiting for the road to come out so we'll see what happens but currently nothing just now so in the next few hours should be a good show it's meant to be forecast so we shall see knowing the aurora it is very tricky to predict so I'm just going to stay out as long as you can hopefully I see a show if I can I'll get some good footage of it good pictures and I'm going to set up a time lapse as well so fingers crossed for it for the past 10-15 minutes there was double bands of the Aurora there were huge big pillars that was dancing to the naked eye so I've got a time lapse going I'll show you the time lapse I've got 50mm 1.8 shooting quite close in so the Aurora looked quite big compared to the horizon uh, so I've got some selfies with the Aurora I've just been going all out in the past 15 minutes because it did just kick off and it was dancing just all under the plough so I'll put loads of pictures up I'll get videos of it, hopefully the time lapse looks good, um, yeah it was phenomenal, uh, hopefully it comes back, you can start to see just there's another wee double band, so hopefully we get some more pillars because we've had countless pillars, I've done panoramas, I've done so much. You can look at the red, you can see there's red way up high up here and you can see all this red, reds and purples, that, that'll that get picked up in probably England and stuff now so folks, people in England will start seeing red on the horizon look at that, it's like the whole horizon the plough and like the pillars just down there there's another wee double arc just up the form there and loads of pillars right, this battery's gonna die We'll put this battery on charge and get another battery and then I'll check the time lapses. just started to pick up a wee bit again there. The green's getting a bit more intense, which is nice. The blue's shining lovely there. Time lapse over there. And look who's came out as well, Orion. Oh, hey. That was beautiful. Lovely Orion there. But I'm sorry Orion, you're not really stealing the show tonight because the Lady Aurora is out. So, I don't know if she'll kick off again, but she's growing a wee bit, so we'll keep an eye on her and hopefully get a few more pictures. Oh, lovely.
pretty much the night now done. The aurora's really fallen past the horizon now. There's a wee bit of cloud over the uh, north as well. So it's pretty much that's a, a done sort of day. There's some high cloud rolling in over in the east, which is forecast, and that is bringing low cloud. So that'll end the night. That was a brilliant night. Really enjoyed it. Hope you enjoy the pictures and the time lapses and stuff. Hopefully they'll come out nice. Um, and yeah, that was a pretty good night. Nice Halloween. It's pretty well, it's Halloween now, 31st of October. Don't know what time it is because the night the clocks have gone back. Uh, so I don't know what time it is now. It's roughly about 1 o'clock, 12 o'clock, whatever it is, on Halloween. So thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And we shall see you next time, hopefully maybe for some more Northern Lights. I don't know. Thank you. Cheers.